In this video, we'll show you how to create a scatter plot of data points here that we have, and then find the correlation coefficient on a TI-8384 calculator. It's quite quick, actually. The hard part is just entering the data. So here's the data that needs to be put in. The explanatory variable is in list 1. That's the x values. Response variable would be in list 2. So I go to the calculator, and I go into my stat, edit, and then I see that in list 1 I have my 25779 and then 1.5 etc through 2.9 in my list 2. Remember to clear something if something is in there you just have to go up to the very top hit clear and enter and it'll clear everything in that column. Alright once it's in there we go to the stat plot area because we're going to create the plot. So I go second stat plot enter into the first one, turn it on, and then the, the scatter plot is right here. Enter, down, make sure this says list 1, list 2. If not, then you choose that by hitting alpha and then second L1, and then you do it again for L2. It is on there. Then we go to zoom down to 9, that's the stats, zoom stat, and then there's our scatter plot. You can obviously see that this is the correct answer. Okay, now we just need the correlation coefficient, so I'll second quit. The first thing we need to do is we need to go second and then down to catalog. We need to turn on the diagnostics. So I move this down and hold it down until diagnostics, you'll see it come up here. Diagnostics on. Click enter. Click enter again. Therefore we know it's on. Now we have the explanatory variable which is the x values in list 1 and the response variable in list 2. In case you do this independently of something what we're doing right now. Then you click stat, highlight calc, go down to number 4, hit enter, and hit enter again. Here is our correlation coefficient 0.96949 or rounding it up 0.9695. So that's how you find or create a scatter plot and find the correlation coefficient on a TI-8384 calculator.